Hi, I'm Ryan and my life is average. Okay, so you guys really liked the first, not the first. You guys liked the last uh, drunk react, oh my God. You guys really liked the last drunk guy reacts to and a lot of you were messaging me, DMing me, hitting me up on Twitter, telling me to do the new Jake Paul music video. I didn't even know Jake Paul had a music video, no hate. I just didn't know it was a thing. I haven't watched it yet, I have it up. It's every day, bro. Uh, so, I already, as you know, jug of wine, which is getting low at this point. I don't know what this is about. I'm guessing a lot of a lot of cars and girls and bragging. Uh, this is no hate to Jake Paul, whatever I say. A, I'm drunk, and B, I don't, you know, what I've met him before, he complimented my shoes. Uh, but yeah, so if you're a Jake Paul fan, you're watching this, I know that he is your Jesus. I get that you, your religion is Team 10. Let's just laugh a little bit, huh? Shall we? Go grab some wine. You're probably like 12 if not, so don't grab some wine. Maybe grab a Juicy Juice. That might have too much fructose in it, and that's bad for you. Grab some water, put some lemon in it. Here we go. Jake Paul, it's every day, bro. That's a huge house, number one. Okay, twins, gotta have twins. There's a Lamborghini. Five million in six months? Well, I've lost 3,000 in six months. Just saying, what's more impressive? You tell me. <laughs> okay, the beat goes on. The the lyrics are a little a little off cuff a little bit. Not too many rhymes. <laughs> it was 4:52. I can imagine just like a remix, like he does a part two. He's like, it was 8:36, and you text me and you were like, yo, like the the, the door was open on your on your Lambo. I shut it, and then it was 8:59, and you were like, hey. Did you buy a pinata for the party tomorrow? You said you were gonna get a pinata, and I was like, no, nah, I didn't get the pinata because the pinatas are, are a little expensive. The record is true, don't make me tell them the truth. And I just dropped some new merch, and it's selling like I got church. Ohio's where I'm from. He's got some new merch, and it's selling like he's got church. Maybe it's because I've been drinking, I can't process that one. It's selling like he's got church. Maybe you got to get up early to go to church. Maybe it's selling out early earlier than expected. Maybe he's selling a, a god-like amount of merch. Maybe the merch is religious. I don't know. I don't know who this guy is. He kind of looks like a, kind of looks like Bieber, but a little more well-fed, a well-fed Bieber. It's every day, bro. Ah, I'm getting uh, some douchey vibes, but I think it might be some sort of like an inside joke. So I'm not gonna. Well, he said he's not from Compton. I don't think that he even had to say that because when you, when you have to say, I'm not from Compton, I think that it goes without saying. At that point, that you're not from Compton. <laughs> you know we stayed Liddy. Did he just throw shade at MagCon? And Digitor? That's some shit right there. I can see Cameron Dow sitting in a seat like, I will get you. A lot of bragging going on. Uh oh. They about to 
They about to Despacito this? I feel like in order to be successful, you need a pair of, of good-looking ethnic twins now. I've been seeing that a lot on, on YouTube. I need to start maybe putting out some Craigslist ads. Maybe that'll help my channel. If I had like two twins here with hair that was up like that, I think that my channel would go up like that. I think that's the point. Everybody here has hair that's going up and their subs are going up. I'm wearing a hat, my hair's pushed back. That could be why I'm sucking. No. Okay. I f with this right now. I think they're about to break up the Daddy Yankee. Martinez twins, there they are. Okay. It's now. This is what I want to clarify here. Uh, it's not every other day. In case you're wondering, it's not every Thursday. It's not every Sunday. I know some every every given Sunday is a thing. It's not. So if you're thinking that, stop. It's every day. Every day, bro. I think this girl is probably very nice. She's very pretty. Maybe rapping. Maybe not. I got him with the hook. I think she meant the punch. I think I could take a punch from her. Maybe she's a fisherman. Fisherwoman. And maybe she's talking to all of the fish out there. Basically giving them a warning that she's going to catch them with a hook. Her hoodie is a little, it's like she washed it and dried it and then it shrunk and she was like, you know what, fuck it. It's LA, it's fashion. You could wear, at LA you could wear anything and, and it could be like, you could wear pants with the crotch cut off, like reverse assless chaps. People would be like, that's dope. I can see your, I can see your dick. That's awesome. And I ain't talking book. Panera is your home. So stop calling my phone. I'm buying like a drone. They buying like a loan. Yeah, I smell good. It's such I mean, I would hope you smell good. I mean, can you imagine the remix again? Just like, yeah, I never quit. I smell like well-fed Justin Bieber's in the background, kind of, with a jacket that looks like it might have been mauled by maybe a small tiger. It was shot well, uh, clearly they have the money for that. I think that it was a little stereotypical. My thing is like, I get that you have a lot of money and that is fantastic and, I, and I'm, that is awesome uh, because I'm still going dollar menu uh, or Taco Bell is a great deal right now. Six tacos for six dollars. Besides the point, I think that it's not needed to just kind of throw it in everybody's face, but I get it being young and successful. Uh, definitely, I will give them a super diverse mix of people. You had Jake Paul, you had well-fed Justin Bieber guy, you had uh, the Martinez twins, who were fire, I will give them that. Uh, you had Tessa Brooks, who was a girl, and she smell she smells good, she doesn't smell bad. All you haters out there, she smells like your boy's cologne. I don't, I don't know if she stole my roommate's cologne, if so, if you could please give that back. Like, there could have been some, I didn't get any lines in there where I was like, ooh, you know, nothing really that got me. A lot of kind of cliches. But hey, his his Rolex is worth more than my family is, which is depressing but also inspiring. I look forward to the follow-up. Um, it's every other week, bro. I think that'll come out maybe in a couple months. If, if Jake Paul ever falls off a bit, maybe it'll be every other week, bro. We'll have to watch their spending habits. So, okay, what do you guys think? Let me know down below. Do you like, did you like the song? Did you hate the song? I'm undecided. I think I'm right in the middle, like a five of 10, which is way better than some that I've reviewed. Um, it's way better than Marilyn Monroe by Daniel Kahn, uh, Cohn. So I'll give him that. Although I think a fox screaming on a track or like a panda yawning. 12 minutes would be better than that girl so that's that hope you enjoyed this video make sure to give it a thumbs up uh as always keep commenting new things for me to react to and uh subscribe if you're new here because uh unlike jake paul it's not you know it's not going well but i'm not gonna stop i will see you guys next time i'm gonna drink my sorrows away for not having a lamborghini
And hey, stay average. Please loan me some money, Jake. Please, I'll give you my PayPal, just DM me. Yeah!